on every ridge that we hike toward the east side, the rocks just absolutely astound me. These things are up at the peak and they're looking out and they're huge. Then we see mountains we haven't looked at before. That one has a clear spot on the top for some farming. There's a community down to the right. That community has been fun to drive through. The people seem to be outdoors activists, very positive for hiking and very positive about the folks traveling the trails. Met a lady last night she probably lives in the area, just out getting her Friday night hike or run across the ridge. <clears throat> and she stopped and she was really interested in hearing the story of a 14 year old who's hiking the Appalachian Trail from Harper's Ferry to Maine. I know it's not the whole way, but that's what this year allows. It's like a lemon squeezer in here. Cool. The trail takes us through some really neat spots. These are those hideaways that you'd never see. Reminds me a little bit about like geocaching where we would find areas in our own neighborhoods in parks that we didn't know existed where somebody found it and hit a nice geocache that was a neat squeeze right there. the lichen on here isn't looking the healthiest but it's springtime well okay guess we come down through here We're having grip on the shoes is very valuable. <laughs> Tempted to turn the screen the other way. <laughs> yeah, you see these rock formations up at the top. And a lot of times you want to walk through them, but they're just impenetrable or you want need to have a little different gear than our running shoes in order to get up on them. But this afforded us the chance to do just that. Looks like the old Appalachian Trail went through there. There's the marking, but it's been remarked and redirected here. <clears throat> there's so many redirections of the Appalachian Trail that I am real sure that 16.9 that we did the other day wasn't really 16.9. We uh, had National Park Service signs once we had hiked about five miles that said 16.9 to where we were heading to Tom's um, something shelter 
but then from back at the street there were some unofficial signs that were saying 16.9 but I have a feeling the state park when they rerouted it put up some nice round signs I think I said National Park Service the state park put up some new signs giving better distances This is the ridge line where we're walking. It's a really unique boulder just up ahead that is actually split. The ridge line gets hit by lightning a lot. I'm wondering if maybe that rock was hit by lightning, Jonathan. See the rock on your left that's split? Why would that rock? On the top of the hill, split down the middle. When the grain of the rock goes the other way, I'm thinking heat, like lightning could do it. Yeah, that sounds good. Onward, yeah. you give perspective to the size of things. <laughs> 